Actually, I thought this is, this is specific to me. Uh, probably no, 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 it's not, specific, it's not specific to you. Mm -hmm. This question is not specific to you, question is general. Mm -hmm. Anyway, specific, if it's there, we'll block it. Yeah. Yes. It's okay? Yeah, yeah. So, the question, your question is, uh, is there a meaning in life? I'm not able to find meaning in life. Yeah. yeah. Okay? Yeah. The life itself has no meaning as such. Mm. Okay? Life is like a blank paper. Mm. The meaning when we say, mm. what is it I'll get out of it? Mm. What is it makes, makes me interesting? Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. This in the result orientation mm -hmm. is always related to the mind. Mm. Okay? Mm. I'll get something out of life. Mm. That is called result orientation. Right, right. The mind is always result oriented. Mm. Okay? Mm. But your consciousness, mm -hmm. consciousness is creative oriented, not re result oriented. Mm -hmm. A creativity, it will create something out of nothing. Mm -hmm. It's actually the entire universe is created out of nothing. Yeah, right. Okay. So, mm -hmm. there's a difference between the result yeah. orientation and creative orientation. Right, right, right. Creative orient orientation, mm -hmm. it just springs, mm -hmm. just appears. It happens. Happens. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm. In that happening, something beautiful gets created mm. and the beautiful gets destroyed also. Mm -hmm. Doesn't matter. You will not be, uh, you will not be worrying about uh, yeah. uh, saving it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a painter. Right, right. It's like an artist. Mm. The universe is like an artist. Mm. Okay. Mm. Which will keep creating various uh, pictures. Mm -hmm. There's a uh, saint is created, sinner is created. Mm -hmm. So everything appears and disappears. Mm -hmm. And there's no uh, attachment to anything. Right, right. Okay? Right. That's say the nature of the universe. Right, right, right. Whereas the nature of the mind is bo <laughs> like, if you, if you want to really say, mm -hmm. God is like an artist. Right, right. Okay? Mm -hmm. Artist doesn't, <laughs> artist will create something. Mm -hmm. Sometimes he creates monsters on the paper. Mm -hmm. Sometimes he creates a, mm -hmm. uh, beautiful flowers. So that is the creativity, yeah. right? Yeah. Then there is no attachment to any of them. Yeah. It's yeah. like a beautiful creation. Yeah. Yeah. The God is an artist. Yeah. But when you say the meaning in life, yeah. it's more like engineer's thinking. Yeah. What do I get out of this? Yeah. Right, right. Okay. Yeah, engineer's view. Uh, okay. It's a more of a result oriented focus. Yeah. So we have to become more like creativity oriented yeah. rather than result oriented. Yeah. Result orientation is required to make our living. Mm -hmm. If I work in a job, some result is to come. Right, right. All those things are required right, right. for living. Right. But life is more creativity oriented rather than result oriented. Right, right, right. And for creativity, mm -hmm. the world is like a plain paper. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what you what what meaning you give that? Mm -hmm. That's the that's your your contribution. Mm -hmm. You become a co-creator in the universe. Right, right. This whole universe is God's creation. Mm -hmm. Okay, Ishwara. Mm -hmm. In that, when you when you are, when you appear in the world. Mm -hmm. Okay, you are a small part of that whole entire creation, hmm. right? Very, yeah, very, 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 very small part. Hmm. But you have a role to play. Hmm. Okay, every every as every every element in the universe hmm. has a role to play. Mm -hmm. Even the insect has a role to play. Mm -hmm. So for you, we can become a co-creator. Mm -hmm. In this, we can add some meaningful meaning to uh, with some add our own meaning. What you perceive as meaning mm -hmm. to this creation, mm -hmm. without getting attached. Mm -hmm. But that's a creativity, not. Based on what is there, yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. So that creativity will spring forth. Mm. The more you touch your consciousness, mm. the more you become, more you become aware of yourself. Mm. The more the creativity flows. Right, right. right. It's, it's like a, uh, it's a flow. Right, right. Okay. Whereas uh, when you use the mind, yeah. uh, it is, it is, it's actually based on the your pre previous impressions. Yeah. Vasanas. Vasanas. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So that's a distinction. Yeah. What you create and what you Reproduce. Mm. So let's. We should we, for life li making living in the world. Mm. We have to be always uh, based on the vasanas. Mm. So if you have to go to a job, you have to become an engineer. Right, right. Engineering profession, you have to apply. Right, right. But the life itself is has to be more creative. Right, right. right. right? That's a distinction. Mm. Now, if your question is, how do I get there? Mm. What do I get there? Mm. Okay. You, you, first, look, two things. Mm. First thing is that. Should I have a purpose to make myself more creatively? No. From mind to consciousness? No, no, no. It, 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 there is no purpose required there. It is it, it's a natural happening. It happens naturally. Yeah. Okay. The more uh, more you become aware, mm. the more you become creative. Can, can't we can't we can't we aim for that? It, ha it you have to become only yeah, aware. No, you you have to for, see. You cannot aim to become creative. Mm. I mean, of course, there are people who are like artists and all. By profession, they are creative. Mm. Okay. Mm. But their creativity still is based on their vasanas. Right. Right. right? They are trained like engineers trained for uh, engineering. Right. Right. Artist is trained for uh, creativity, right. 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 but the real art blooms 
when he touches consciousness right right okay hmm. that's what happened in case of uh, people like uh, tyagaraja hmm. or uh, uh, they, they are musicians yeah, yeah. okay yeah. initially their music will be more of based on their vasanas right. impressions right. They, what they learned right, right. but when they touch their consciousness the music blooms right right okay there's right. a creative touch comes into picture right, right. which is very very different taste right, right. and that's what happens uh, for a gnani hmm. okay for example osho hmm. rajnish was uh, a professor of philosophy hmm, right. and then he teaches from books hmm. but when he gets gnan when he gets enlightened hmm. that has a very a different flavor hmm. okay the same teaching will continue same vasanas will continue hmm. but they will continue with a different flavor hmm. that they will they will come with a flavor of uh, 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 what do you call it what do you call it uh, uh, expressing silence and peace in their cells so there is a there is a there is a difference between the conditioned mind and the unconditioned mind any any mind is, any knowledge is conditioned yeah any knowledge is conditioned okay even when dani is there he has to use a conditioned mind to express the unconditioned okay because ultimately it has to be a body mind vehicle only right right right, right? Mm. so the difference will be mm. in uh, when you, when somebody becomes enlightened or become uh, liberated mm. their mind will become so peaceful mm. they express the peace and love through that mm. Mm. okay the mm. same words words will be same mm. but there will be somewhere that uh, touch of uh, peace love compassion will uh, yeah. flow through that right right, right. right? that's because they have touched that inner consciousness right. inner self right. okay mm. so now can you accelerate it no mm. you cannot in the in the sense all that you can do is you can always go back to yourself hmm. okay hmm. the more and more you go back to yourself the more and more mind gets transformed hmm. okay hmm. so then more and more creativity flows right so there is no meaning in life hmm. okay but meaning you give the meaning to life hmm. there's a difference right, right the meaning itself if somebody gives the meaning to life then you are a prisoner hmm. prisoner of the meaning prisoner of the meaning hmm. there's no meaning hmm. like there are many people who are prisoners of the meaning in life hmm. somebody says a lot of so, so many isms are there hmm. people fight for the isms people fight for uh, yeah. uh, the survival yeah, yeah. okay yeah. but these these are all meanings given by somebody yeah, yeah. they are not original meanings right right, right? Mm. that that meanings given by somebody in the form of isms mm. different isms mm. right mm-hmm. what isms means uh, all capitalism this like so. all this capitalism communism all this isms yeah, right. okay that you are is meaning given by somebody and you are just blindly following it mm. then you are a prisoner mm. okay but really the meaning comes mm. when you touch your consciousness mm. then you express that mm-hmm. there is a real meaning which you give to the uh, life mm-hmm. right there is a small story there there is a small book uh, mm-hmm. called uh, man's search for meaning in life yeah. oh, victor franklin victor franklin right mm-hmm. so i don't know whether you have read it i just started it actually okay he goes through a lot of uh, struggle in life yeah. uh he was imprisoned by uh, nazis mm. and he was about to be executed mm. because of a lot of trouble in life mm-hmm. and he finds that life is very miserable in the nazi camp mm-hmm. but everybody has lost lost hopes mm-hmm. of living mm. they don't want to live mm. dying is better mm. but he finds he was a doctor mm. while treating a patient many patients want to die in that condition mm-hmm. one patient seems to be glowing and happy mm-hmm. at the time of death mm-hmm. so he asks him why mm. he says uh, i am dying anyway mm. i know i am dying mm. and i pray to god mm. that let me take my life as sacrifice and stop this war mm. Mm. and god accepted it mm. so he is finding meaning in his life also mm. so you can you can you, this that ultimate that doesn't create mind creation again no no i'm saying there is a peace mm-hmm. okay so it's a mind creation mm. but ultimately you are giving meaning to life mm. either because of vasanas or because of uh, creativity okay. <laughs> so if you if you are trying to find meaning in life yeah. there is nothing you will find meaning of some given by somebody mm-hmm. okay it's his his creation mm-hmm. so now there is no such thing everybody's ideas are there mm-hmm. so you can follow communism you can follow socialism you can follow hinduism yeah. christianity all isms are there yeah, yeah, yeah. but ultimately they are all meanings given right, right. the moment you you get into meaning meanings given by the society right. you are trapped in that right, right. now if you want to find your own meaning mm-hmm. you have to go to consciousness right, right. okay or <laughs> you have to create your own meaning hmm. right right the creativity is flow right right so anyways even if i am a creator of even if i create my own meaning i'll be prisoner of it right 
So because no, no, I'm saying in the, in, the, in the creativity, uh, no, no, you see, you create your own meaning mm. that you have to do anyway in life mm. because of survival. Mm. You want to join, join a company, you have to follow the company policies and you have to do. Right, right. That you have to do because you are within the framework you have to do. Right, right, right. But if you ask, mm. what is the meaning I have to, meaning I'll find life, mm. the life itself is no meaning. Mm. Right, right. Okay. Now all this uh, life profession are required mm. for survival. Mm. Right, and within the framework, you try to do find the meaning. Hmm. So, why I'll do uh, why, why I'm working? I have to earn money. Hmm. Why I have to earn money? Because I have to survive. Hmm. Why I have to survive? Because I have to get, I have to take, take care of myself. Yeah. All that, like that, you can give meanings. Yeah, yeah. Okay, they're all uh, what I call as uh, utility meanings. Yeah, yeah. Utility, yeah. Okay, Exic uh, existential meanings uh, yeah. you cannot give from the what is there. Yeah. Right? right, for getting to existential meanings, hmm. uh, you have to. Again and again, go back to your unconditioned consciousness, self. Mm -hmm. Then uh, the inner creativity blooms. Mm -hmm. And the inner creativity blooms, mm -hmm. you'll give existential meaning. Mm -hmm. Okay? Even that will be limited your, by your body mind complex. Mm -hmm. It will not be unlimited. Yeah, yeah. It will yeah. Ultimately, it's everything will be limited by your uh, uh, vehicle. vehicle yeah. But yeah. then uh, you will express love, peace, compassion yeah. through that uh, yeah. vehicle. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, the source is inag inexhaustible, huh. but uh, the body mind will be limited. But uh, that's okay. Hmm. But instead of getting, instead of being the trap of body mind, huh. and tapping into source is uh, anyway far more. Better. Yeah, yeah. But what will happen in that? Hmm. Even if you created a small thing, hmm. it'll have a beauty in that. Huh. It'll have a, uh, it'll have a existential beauty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. Whereas uh, the existential beauty is like uh, there's a flower here, mm -hmm. which is existential. Mm -hmm. Compared to that, a plastic flower. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Human mind, life in it. Huh. You can see the life in it. Yeah. Human mind has a human mind creates a plastic flower, mm -hmm. whereas existence creates a living flower. Right, right. Like that, but living flower may not be valuable. Mm -hmm. Okay, this flower nobody can buy it. Mm -hmm. Probably plastic flower, maybe a flower people can buy it a uh, mm -hmm. uh, few hundred rupees. Yeah, yeah. Okay, don't cut, cut don't uh, uh, compare that uh, meaning with the value yeah, yeah. which society gives. Yeah, yeah that's okay. Huh. But, but because see, as long as we are fulfilled, huh. what outcome it does it doesn't matter. No, no. We are, are, it is a, no, 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 no. Actually, mm -hmm. uh, you don't get fulfilled by existential. Mm -hmm. When you are fulfilled, they, the creativity flows. Mm -hmm. It's the other way. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 <laughs> Not because of creativity, you get fulfilled. Mm -hmm. the cre it, 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 when you are fulfilled, the creativity flows. Okay. okay. When you are, when you touch the existence, mm -hmm. you are fulfilled. Yeah. You are full of bliss. Yeah, yeah. In that, the creativity flows. Mm -hmm. Not because of creativity, you get fulfilled. Yeah. Other way. Okay. okay. That is created because of creative to get fulfilled is a mind's creation. Okay. I want something to get fulfilled. Okay. okay. They are different. Yeah. yeah. It's because uh, the begin everything has to begin from begin from me. If you, yeah. It's like not from the mind. Huh. Everything has to come from the self. Self. Yeah. Now that we cannot know when it will happen. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's all uh, a natural process. Mm -hmm. All that you can do is uh, you can keep going back to self. You can. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, I mean, you can become more and more self-aware. Hmm. When that creativity, inner creativity blooms, you don't know because yeah. that everything has its own uh, cycle. Yeah, yeah. A yeah. flower, uh, you cannot make it, make it bloom uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, rapidly, right? right. right? So you cannot force it. it you cannot force it. Naturally. It has to happen naturally. 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 There's a natural cycle for that. Yeah. So all that you can say is uh, that okay, yeah. your real inner creativity blooms when you touch your consciousness. Right. That I can say. Right. But the more you touch, the more creativity starts blooming. It's not that one day it will happen. Yeah, yeah. Every day, yeah. every day it will happen. It will start blooming a little bit, little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We can see that in ourselves. Every yeah, day. every day, right? Yeah. So that's how it is. Uh, and now, in that creativity, you are not finding meaning in creation. You are giving meaning to creation. Mm -hmm. Meaning to creation, yeah. Okay? Yeah. So that's the difference. Finding meaning is a mind's job. Yeah. Giving meaning to, uh, meaning to creation is a God's job. Uh -huh. So now, when you start touching your consciousness, yeah. you become a co-creator. Mm -hmm. Okay? When you say you are Brahma, mm -hmm. Brahma is a creator. Mm -hmm. You become a part of the co-creation. You are also mini Brahma. Mm -hmm. You become a part of co-creation. You create something beautiful yeah. in this world. Yeah. That's how life is. Mm -hmm. Human mind can create only plastic flowers, mm -hmm. ugly. Yeah. Yeah. Whereas uh, the nature can create beautiful flowers. Yeah, yeah. Now whether people pay for their beautiful flowers yeah. or uh, not, we don't know. Yeah. But ultimately, it is yeah. the beautiful. Yes. So, yeah. At the end of the day, probably I'm, I can. If, you, if I ask, if I have to put it this way, probably I'm, I'm looking for fulfillment. Probably. You are looking for fulfillment, yeah. and you have to go back to the self. Yeah. Okay. So there is also another part of the fulfillment, mm. right? Mm. So it is not that you have to become, you have to become wait for getting back to the self all the time. Mm -hmm. Getting back to the self is one way, mm. and bringing a little bit of smile, mm. peace in somebody's face mm. is also fulfillment. Yeah. 
so giving is fulfillment hmm. okay yeah. what happens is we are trying to get fulfillment it can't we can't get yeah, yeah. fulfillment you cannot get right. but you can give fulfillment hmm. you can bring a little bit of peace and smile to society hmm. somewhere hmm. whatever is worth it it is not that it will be everlasting yeah, yeah. what to whatever extent one can whatever extent hmm. that's why it's called service, service yeah. so life is self relation service hmm. the more you touch self the more you become fulfilled hmm. more you fulfill, more you fulfill the more you contribute hmm. okay right into into the yeah so that is the general it has to begin from within right i'm saying that you know the touch of the consciousness has to happen because even if even if the touch of consciousness is not there the giving doesn't have value is it no no giving has always value Mm. see mm. But, uh, yeah not everybody will have a touch of consciousness mm. giving always has a value mm. because people feel more fulfilled mm. when you give mm. Mm. okay mm. even uh, they don't they don't touch consciousness because in the inner urge of the consciousness always is there mm. to give mm-hmm. they god or the uh, god or consciousness it just gives mm-hmm. your sunlight okay yes. the inner environment yes. there's no asking of, oh you do puja for me yes. okay you do worship for me you think of me there's nothing like that right, right. it's just giving right, right, right. the giving is natural to human beings right, right. okay yeah. so when you are in giving yeah. right you are already naturally already in the, it's also self only yeah yeah you are in the present moment you are present moment you are in the present moment you are the, there in the self only yeah, yeah, yeah. okay it's it's not that giving is you have to discount from, from no no uh-huh. they are actually one flow right, right. self relation and service right. they are one flow right. there you cannot separate out right. so you cannot say that one day you become self realized and then you do service hmm. it doesn't work that way hmm. so you yeah it can it has to happen parallelly or both there there two, there one, there two one there two aspects of one same thing okay, okay. self service is when you see the self in everywhere everywhere hmm. so when you say self hmm. self is not just here hmm. the self is all this hmm. okay yeah. so self relation not just the eyes closed hmm. self is all that is self only yeah 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 so when you do service we are actually trying to remove your ignorance same right, thing right 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 so how, what is the criteria what do i do hmm. so that criteria for there hmm. is just be just bring peace and happiness to others hmm. peace and happiness is what i value hmm. peace and happiness to others is what you give right, right. in what way whatever skills you have right. whatever ability you have right. whatever action you can do right. you bring that's also the outer direction is bring happiness and peace to others in that direction is seeking peace within so that's a continuous flow it is not uh, uh, there's no what i'm saying so so yeah uh, yeah i got it so it's like it's an expression of one thing only ha huh. so it's called atmano mokshartham jagaditaya cha so realization of self and uh, uh, service so they are uh, one and the same aspects of uh, reality they are not two so you know our mind splits uh, into splits the reality into inner reality and outer reality there's no inner reality and outer reality there's only one reality she has gone i think i think you can stop okay so this is called atmano moksha par jagadidaya cha for self realization service now this no, is you cannot say that one day i'll get self realized i'll do service ha ah, it's not like that <laughs> it's not like that so but then also what happened is you can make it a goal you cannot go it's a continuous process hmm. then uh, because self is already realized right. you know you are actually uh, you, uh, uh, you, you are already are the self ha you are already the self hmm. so only mind is obstacle hmm. that obstacle for the mind we are uh, purifying hmm. in the both the process hmm. right hmm. so that way it is self relation service is called atmano mokshartham jagaditaya cha mm-hmm. and uh, when you really start becoming more and more peaceful mm-hmm. more and more beautiful and uh, peaceful things flow out of you mm-hmm. otherwise uh, what things flows out of you will have a noise of uh, vasanas okay, yeah. but doesn't matter that's how it is life yeah. okay yeah. start